guys today we're gonna to take a look at the uh, bushcraft outfitters mest poncho this is the size large and OD green I'm gonna set it up as a shelter and uh, see how that goes first time I've used it so let's see what happens so first thing I always have on the end of my ridge line is just a, a dedicated loop that I've already tied that way, when I get to camp and I want to start setting this thing up, uh, it's ready to go. I'll just loop that through there. Hold that tight. Gonna put a couple toggles in here. I got a couple pre tied lines, just a couple loops. I'm gonna tie those off in my corners and stake them down with a couple sticks in the back. All right, hopefully you can see that uh, what I did is I just took those pre-tied loops I already had in my kit and girth hitched them to the tabs on the corners and then staked it out with a stick, no big deal. Uh, pretty easy to do, quick, and it's pretty effective too. So now we gotta tie this fit off. Tighten that up.
All right, I got my ground cleared off a little bit. I'm gonna fire up the alcohol stove. Make some coffee for the afternoon. Had a nice short hike in today. Got the tarp set up. Now here's here's a little tip that I learned the hard way with alcohol stoves. And it's probably a no-brainer for some people, but you know. Put the supports on before you light the darn thing because once you get this thing lit and then you're trying to fiddle with these supports and getting them on the actual stove, you're gonna end up burning yourself. What I do is I just kind of put my hand over it, check it, I can feel the heat so I know it's working. And this thing's gonna start jetting up here in a little bit. That's the deceptive thing about um, alcohol stoves. You can't hardly ever see the flame, but you can hear it. All right, it's coffee time. A little coffee talk. Good. You looking at me? Are you looking at me? Are you looking at me? Don't look at me. Subscribe to my channel. Then you can look at me all you want. Yeah. So guys, thanks for watching. Prepared Wanderer. Uh, please subscribe if you if you really like these videos. I'm, I'm definitely going to be doing more. It's a learning experience for me. It's something that's really new for me. Um, but I'm enjoying it, and I'm hoping you guys are too. Thanks a lot. Okay, so <laughs> something I just found in the woods. A uh, folding chair. It's amazing when I finally come out here. This is close to a, a lake, so there's just uh, garbage everywhere. Um, I hate to say it, but it's a lot of uh, stuff left over from guys who are fishing. And I know most fishermen are better than that, but there's a kind of a lower class citizen, I think, that comes out here to fish. And they just leave their garbage everywhere. Beer cans, cigarette butts, bait cups, and folding chairs. So, you know, why ever bring a chair to the woods when there's a perfectly good one right here? I don't know. Maybe not that good.